All right, so guys, in this video, I want to change tunes uh, with what I normally do, which is the stock market stuff. And I want to be looking at the Australian economy in itself. Something is not right with what's going on right now. They just cut interest rates once again. They just cut them down to, as you can see, right? Look at this here. The, uh, the Reserve Bank of Australia lowered the cash interest rate by 25 basis points to a new record low to 1.25 in June, is what, as widely expected. Right, this is, look at this here. Look at this here, for the last couple of years, down, 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 and then they dropped it down again. It's like, how, I don't get this. The Australian market, right? Maybe maybe other stuff that's happening right now is, is underneath the surface, but obviously there is, right? Because the Australian property market, yes, we're getting some softening for the last couple of years, but prior to that, we had like 100% growth in like five years or something. Now, if I go to, let's say, like a five-year curve, uh, that is five years, isn't it? We go to one year, All right? Look at that one year, and then now we just dropped it down there. One year, and go to 10 years. Look at this over the last 10 years. Last couple of years, the market has softened, yes. But look at this here, right? 2010, we rose interest rates. Then 2012, right, we started to drop it down through here. If I go to the max... Look at this here. It's like, this is, something's not right. Because normally, right, normally interest rates would be quite high when the mark, when things are, when things are good, things are happening. But we, we had a, <laughs> we had a little rise back here. Let's go to 10 years, right? We had a little rise back in 2010, but then we started the drop up again, 2012 to 2000 and maybe 14, 16, the property market was actually, you know, the property market was, we, we had a massive, massive, massive boom in the markets. So we haven't even started a recession yet. So I, I would hate, I would hate to see what's going to happen when when we actually do start the recession with the, with the Australian market. So I just wanted to share this with you here, me as being an Aussie and saying, man, this is, this is crazy, isn't it? Look at this here, right? Went from 15% down here, down to, and it stayed around pretty average around 5%. And now we're just going down, 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 down. Something is not right with the Australian economy. Even though we've just had one of the biggest booms in, in, in Australian history in property market. Um, yes, yes, we have been softening for the last couple of years. But man, they, you know, man, once again, the interest rates, they're just nowhere near. So if we start to really see some things happening in the markets, maybe maybe they're trying to play catch up right now because the property market has been softening. It's pretty crazy right now. And I'm just looking at this right now. I'm just thinking, wow, this is this is um, something's not right here. Something is not right. And when we start the recession, and we start the next recession. My goodness, the Australian interest rate is probably going to go down to zero for the very first time, and maybe even negative for the very first time. It is absolutely crazy out there. And um, once again, guys, like we went through for um, apart from the last couple of years prior to that, we went through like a hundred percent growth. Everything just took off like a rocket. It was big time. But the the interest rates really didn't do much, right? They rose them a little bit. Mm. Maybe it's from three to say four and a half, right? Um, but then, but then, guess what? And then suddenly it's been going down ever since. So, man, they're low right now. I hate to see what happen. What, what's what's happening when the when the when the recession really starts? Or maybe maybe the recession has already started underneath the surface. We just can't see it yet. The stock market, by the way, the property, the XJO, which is the Australian, um, uh, the the top the top indexes in uh, in Australia. That's at an all-time new high, so something's not right. Let me know what you think in the chat box below. Hey traders, thanks for watching my YouTube video. You know that there's a lot of areas in the trading arena, right, to, for you to become a good trader, right? There's the trading systems, there's the chart reading strategies, there's the foundations, the mindset, and there's so many areas, right, you need to really understand in order for you to become a good trader. So that's what I've created the Master Trader Lab. I put everything in there for you to become a really, really good trader, and I'm giving you a free trial. So if you go to mastertraderlab.com and you can grab a free trial to this and start learning the chart reading strategies, the trading systems, the mindset, so much more in there and start to learn the skills to become what I call a master trader. So go to mastertraderlab.com.